Hi, so my name is Kevin Ruthven and part of the Navajo Nation Christian Response Team. And you know, the Navajo Nation Christian Response Team has, over the last several months, been the church. You know, a lot of people over the last several months because of COVID, they feel like their churches are shut down and we can't do anything. Well, the church isn't a building. The church isn't a place you go to. The church is a group of people. It's not something you do, it's something you are. And, and here, we have been we have been so incredibly blessed. We've had people of all different types of nationalities serving together. People of all different types of ages that have come here to serve. And, and people from all around the country that have come here. People who are local, people who are distant. We've had churches from all over the Southwest, from California to Texas, send in supplies. We've had people from all over the country donate money donate masks. There was one woman in Texas who made over a thousand masks for us to put in our care packages. So every day we would get items that would come in and we would have a team that would decontaminate items. Then we'd have a team that would bring in the items once they were decontaminated and they would organize them on tables and they would organize them in the building so care package teams could come and, and put together care packages. And as they put these care packages together, we had all kinds of different food items that we would put inside of them, different cleaning items. We'd be able to put toilet paper in them, but we would also be able to put information about COVID. And even more importantly, we were able to put the Bible in whether it was a Gospel of Mark or a Gospel of John in every single care package with a note, just letting them know that they're a friend of ours and that we care about them and that there's a God in heaven who loves them and with phone numbers where they could call for prayer. You know, it, it just makes me think of Lamentations chapter three. In Lamentations chapter three, the prophet was going through a hard time. It was Jeremiah. And Jeremiah said, I had no hope when I thought about the future. But a couple of verses later, he says, but then I recalled this to mind and I have hope that the mercy and the compassion, the faithfulness of God are new every morning. God is good to those who seek him. And I think that was the message that through every care package we wanted to communicate to people that maybe they're feeling hopeless, but these care packages help bring them to recall to their minds that there's a God in heaven who's for them, who is not against them. And so if you're interested in, in being a part of the Navajo Nation Christian Response Team and joining in maybe future deployments, or you want to generously give to the Navajo Nation Christian Response Team financially, or even more than all of that is just your prayers. Pray for the Navajo Nation Christian Response Team. We'd love to have, to have your partnership. And you can check out the Navajo Nation Christian Response Team um, webpage. You can look at their Facebook page and find other ways that you can be a part of this. Again, we're a response team. We're responding to those that are broken. We're responding to those that are in need. And really the truth is all of us are broken at times. All of us are in need and we all know what it's like for someone to come alongside of us and, and, and give us a hand and help pull us up again so we can stand on our feet in the love of God. And that again is what the Navajo Nation Christian Response Team is about. We want, again, we want people to know that there's a God in heaven who's for them. And because of that, they can have hope. So we would love to have you join us. Thank you. Thank you.